What's up dudes, it's your best buddy in the whole frickin' galaxy, Urban Blaster, playing some Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. It's that free-to-play mobile game because I don't pay for this shit. And if you if you're not haven't heard, there's some new uh, characters out there. The one we'll be looking at in this video is frickin' Death Trooper. He's a frickin' new Empire dude, and he has some synergy with the uh, director Kenrick. But uh, before we uh, go into the new event, let's take a look at the uh, Death Trooper and his abilities. Okay, dudes, here's the Death Trooper. He's that Dark Side Empire attacker who uh, inflicts debilitating debuffs and prevents revives. He uh, looks like a pretty wicked ass character. I like that uh, helmet with the green lenses, but let's take a look at his abilities. Here's his basic it's the Trackdown. That thing deals physical damage to a target enemy with a 70% chance to inflict days for three turns. If you're not familiar with days, that's a debuff that when a, when one of your enemies gets days, they can't assist, they can't counterattack or gain bonus turn meter. So that's pretty good, taking away some turn meters from them. And if uh, it's so, you know, you want to go after those dudes who you uh, who have assists or, or counters or have a good chance of getting their turns up. But then uh, if the target was already dazed, it stuns them for one turn. If the target is a rebel, it attacks again. So that's pretty good. He's putting a hurting on a... He's doing that old double molly wop against a rebel. And then his next uh, special is the uh, Death Trooper Grenade. This thing uh, deals physical damage to all enemies. It's a frickin' AoE. And it dispels all buffs on them. With the 70% chance to inflict healing immunity for two turns. Enemies who are not buffed have their cooldowns increased by one. Holy crap, that's pretty uh, badass. It's a frickin' grenade that takes away the green off the enemies' heads. And a frickin' uh, 70% chance to do healing immunity and if uh, they didn't have a buff it frickin uh, t increases their cooldowns by one frick man that's pretty badass AOE then he has the terminate this is his other special this thing deals physical damage to a target enemy if the target is suffering any debuffs this attack is a guaranteed critical hit if there are any uh, defeated enemies also inflicts the death mark for two turns. Targa uh, defeated by this by terminate cannot be revived. Holy crap! So this is this thing will uh, take out Boba Fett with that thing if he has that bounty hunter's resolve. And if you uh, take him out with this terminate, there's no way he could revive. So that's pretty cool. It's a counter to all old Daka and the Ewok Yowler too. What else does this thing say it does? It deals physical damage to a target enemy. If the target is suffering any debuffs, the attack is guaranteed critical hit. So if they got the red above their head, it's going to be a freaking critical hit. And if there are any De defeated enemies. It also inflicts death mark for two turns. That's uh, pretty wicked right there too. Then he has his uh, unique, the Krennic Guard. Whenever Death Trooper scores a critical hit, he and Director Krennic recover 20% health. That's that whole synergy with him and Krennic. If he gets a freaking critical hit, he's going to be uh, bumping up healths. And then the, the Death Trooper has a 50% chance to gain 100% turn meter whenever Director Krennic takes damage. Director Krennic cannot, can't be uh, critically hit while Death Trooper is alive, so you can't uh, frickin' put a hurtin' on Krennic if the Death Trooper's there. But he is the uh, Krennic's uh, right-hand man, you know. But that's pretty badass. I believe the... Uh, the Krennic Guard is where his uh, Zeta is, so uh, part of that is when you get it zeta out. But uh, let's go uh, take a look at the event where we could get score some shards for this dude, or maybe even unlock him. Okay, dudes, here we are. It's the frickin' uh, Special Operations uh, number two. It, it, this is where you earn uh, Death uh, Trooper shards. Let's see what this thing's all about. This says it's recommended for level 30. Strategy chips, uh, Death Trooper, basic attack, track down, and inflict days. Okay, sounds like we'll steamroll this if it's a level 31. We'll be uh, borrowing the Death Trooper. Okay, looks like we could roll with the pretty uh, much all of our dudes. Who should we go with on this? Um, I don't know who, we'll, who we will be battling against, but let's uh, roll with the Dark Side dudes, the Empire. 
So we got Emperor Palpatine, we got freaking TIE Fighter Pilot, Boba Fett. He's not an Empire dude, but he's a wicked ass dark side dude. Who else? Um the Dark Lord Sith himself and uh Don't know yeah, there's Short Trooper. Frickin' A, let's do this shit. Short Trooper's only level uh three stars, but he's at gear nine. He's a frickin' beast already. Okay, we're gonna be going up against a bunch of Jawas, so some AoEs of uh, applying de buff immunities. Oh, we crushed uh, that one. Two of two, it's the final encounter. Yeah. Okay, here we go. AoE's taking away their abilities. Jetpack in. Okay, now we'll frickin' uh, just stun this dude. Bam, victory. That wasn't even a frickin' fight. Let's check out the loots, dudes. We got uh, 25 uh, Death Trooper shards. And we pretty much uh, unlocked that dude. Let's see what else we could do in this frickin' event. Tier 2, guys. Should we roll with the the same uh, team? Hell yeah. Did uh, Death Trooper even get a frickin' turn? I don't think so. But uh, let's see if he gets a turn this go-round. I want to see that wicked uh, Empire attacker in action. Okay. Since there's just two levels, let's just uh, slowly whittle these dudes down. Bam! Let's just one-shot all these dudes. I want to see the frickin' Death Trooper get a turn. Bam! Oh! Frick, man. Okay, here's the Death Trooper. Which one should we try? What's this one? This is the, uh, the Terminate. That one's pretty badass. Okay, we'll, uh, try his basic. Remember, this is the one that deals physical damage to a target enemy with a 40% chance to inflict days for two turns. If the target is a rebel, that doesn't apply. Bam! No frickin' days? That's bullshit. Now TIE Fighter Pilot has to frickin' step up. Frick, man. We'll save all the big guns for the next round. Okay, two of two. It's the final encounter. Yeah. Okay, let's frickin' bring it on. This stuff better not have froze up. Okay, here we are. Yes, the uh, Def Trooper's up. Let's try his... Uh, damn, there's no green above their head, so we won't do that one. Should we try the execute? Okay, let's uh, do the execute on uh, old Greedo out there. <laughs> now we'll uh, just stun all these dudes. Now we'll uh, put a hurtin' on Zam Wessel. AoE's uh, taking away their abilities. Jetpack in. Okay, we'll put Dengar out of his frickin' misery. Now Boba Fett. We'll do the calling blade. That should end his miserable life. 24,000 victory! Let's see the loots, dudes. I'm excited. Ten more shards. Where's the frickin' gear? I need some gear, dudes. Drop me some gear. Maybe a cuff or some frickin' uh, furnaces. Okay, this one says recommended for level 60 or above. We're not scared. Let's do this. Why don't you just throw me a frickin' uh, TIE Fighter Pilot in there? Why do I gotta choose if there's nobody to choose from? Okay, I mean a uh, Death Trooper, but let's do this shit. Okay, AOE's doing some buff immunities. Now we'll uh, put a hurtin' on this dude with all the green. Jet pack in! Bam! Now we'll, uh, we'll save his, uh, major weapon for next round. Don't want to get too, uh, ahead of myself and, uh, screw myself in the end. We'll just get rid of this dude. Okay, okay. Now we'll do his basic, see if we get some days. No frickin' days, that man. It's pissing me off. Let's see if, uh, Boba Fett gets the bonus attack, and he did, he did. TIE Fighter Pilot should put him to rest. Bam! 8,000. It's the final encounter. Yeah! Okay, dudes. Starting off with the uh, Force Crush. Put a bunch of red above their head. Now we'll do some AoEs inflicting buff immunities. Now we'll do the Calling Blade against uh, IG-88. He's 86's cool cousin. Bam! 20,000. Frick, he didn't even know what it hit him. It was like a frickin' train hit him. TIE Fighter Pilot will put Greedo to rest. 15,000. Now we'll uh, put a hurtin' on Zam Wessel over there. Okay, let's do a, uh, let's take that stealth off of a uh, good old Dengar with the uh, Death Trooper Grenade. Deals physical damage to all enemies and dispels all debuffs on them with a 70% chance to inflict healing immunity for two turns. Bam! Now Dengar's visible. You can't hide from us, man. Bam! Okay, now we'll execute uh, 
Sam Wessel over there. 20,000. Okay, let's do the uh, Terminate. He can't be revived after this hits him. That was a uh, pretty good damage done. But TIE Fighter Pilot will do the rest. Victory! Okay, let's see uh, what's going on now. Ten more uh, shards and some dineros. I like it. Except for they need to give me some freaking gear. Okay, final uh, one, level 80 and above recommended. We'll uh, be using a 7 star gear 10 freaking death trooper. Hopefully he has the Zeta. Let's see. All his abilities aren't freaking one. I don't uh, get too upset, Urban. It's okay. We'll uh, still kick some major ass. Okay, dudes, let's see if my uh, Empire team's ready for this shit. Crap, these little Jows are fast. AoE's inflicting buff immunities. Okay, now we'll, uh, who has a turn coming up? Let's see if we can get rid of, oh, now it's taunting. We'll, uh, get rid of the taunt with the execute, knock that green off his head, 18,000. Now we'll, uh, tase these dudes with frickin' Palpatine. Now we'll force crush them. A lot of red above their heads. Calling blade time, we'll take out, uh, this Jow engineer. Oh! Okay, now we'll, uh, take out, uh, this... The generic Jawa right there. We'll uh, just do his basic, put him out of his frickin' misery. Now we'll put a hurtin' on this dude, he's... Why not? Or this one, he has the most Dacha. He has the most turn meters. Okay, this dude's up next. TIE Fighter Pilot will frickin' put a hurtin' on him. Bonus attack? Yep, yeah, for Dipper, Skippy! We got that bonus attack! Damn it, I didn't want these dudes to get another turn. Let's frickin' annihilate him. Well, but it, but the good thing we're uh, going through all this rigmarole because now we're just getting back all of our specials and stuff. Ready for a uh, two of two. Bonus attack? Nope, not that time. Crap, man, this dude's just freaking relentless. Now he's gonna freaking pissing me off. Okay, just to keep your head in the game, man. We gotta focus. Put a hurting on this thing. When are we ever gonna get that freaking daze? Two of two. It's the final encounter. Yeah. Okay. Don't get too uh, cocky, man. Just uh, keep focused. AoE's it with buff immunities. Oh, all of them got it. Now we'll uh, put a hurtin' on Greedo. Now we'll uh, do this one. But take away their critical uh, hits. No crit, crit hits now. Check it out. Can't be critically hit. Okay. TIE Fighter Pilot. Now we'll force crunch these dudes. Calling Blade time. We'll go get Greedo out the scene. Greedo, why'd you gotta go? Did you see that? 22,000? Can't wait till my Vader 7 stars. Now we'll do some uh, ability box, hopefully, on Boba Fett. Oh, it didn't stick. Crap, he ex almost took out our tank. He took out our tank. Let's stun these fools with the Palpatine. Bam! Now uh, we'll uh, put a hurtin' on Boba Fett. Now we'll uh, AoE's taking away their abilities. Jetpack in! No, AoE's all around. I know that was a waste, we should have used his basic, but now we'll uh, just use his basic now on frickin' IG-88. Oh, 14,000. Now we'll uh, think on no buff, so... Crap, we'll save the Terminate for uh, Boba Fett. We don't want him reviving, right? He doesn't even have that ma that uh, Bounty Hunter's Resolve, though. What, where'd it go? Did we knock the green off his head or something? I don't frickin' know. I don't remember that. Oh! Crap! At least we got the revive. Frick, man. I don't want to lose any more dudes. We'll uh, put Dangar out of his frickin' misery. Oh, close! But no cigar! He got that critical hit, so he went into hiding. Hide from that, dude! Frick, man. Okay. Shoot. If we could, uh, whittle him down. Damn it, we can't do the... Uh, I think we used up his frickin', uh, the one that doesn't allow revives anyway. Okay, the more red above his head, the better the TIE Fighter pilot is. Oh crap, he came back with them and a bonus attack. So now he got that frickin', uh, pissed. Calling Blade? Oh. Crap, man. This won't get rid of that thing, right? No. Nope. Uh, we tried, but I knew the Mandalor the Bounty Hunter's Resolve can't be debuffed. Frick, this one's a little bit hard. He's, they're whittling us down at frickin' nothing. 
I think we got this though. Frick, man. I'll be pissed if we don't get this. He got the mandal the bounty hunters is all frick. Okay, I guess we have to send in the frickin' rebels. <sighs> Sorry, dudes, didn't want to make this video this long. Frickity frack. We'll uh, go with the throw with the rebels throw. Wedge and Tilly's lead. Scare of Pathfinder dude. Big Stark Lighter. Lando! That smooth criminal from Cloud City. And maybe, uh, hmm, who would go good with these dudes? I don't want to use Biston. He's not ready yet for the... We'll go with the Palpatine. I like that dude. Let's do this shit. This time we're going to frickin' steamroll it. Pissed now. Frick, man. You want to taunt? Taunt this, fool. Crap, that didn't even do that much. At least we got uh, AOEs to take out the rest while this dude taunts. Make it rain some blood on these fools. Now we'll, uh, AOE's all around. Well, except for Scare Pathfinder, dude. We'll, uh, hold off. Crap, I could have deep up those frickers. Oh, no match. Lando will, uh, clean it up for us. Frick, man. So we did get the days, it looks like, from, uh, where you can't assist counterattack or gain bonus turn meter. Bam! Two of two. It's the final encounter. Yeah! Okay. We're making rain some blood on these scoundrels. Now we'll uh, put a double molly wop on um, Bubble Fett. Try to get rid of him before he gets that man. That uh, I always called the Mandalorian Resolve, but that was what it was called before. Now it's the frickin' uh, um, Bounty Hunters Resolve. Make rain some blood on these fools. AOE's uh, from Wedge and TLE's. We're the ones who jet pack, not you. Shoot, we, they got those bounty hunter thermals over our heads now. Okay, what to do, what to do. Let's just get rid of Boba Fett. That was the, the whole frickin' guy who took us out last time. Make a ring some blood on these fools. Bam! I wonder why their Boba Fett didn't get uh, the bounty hunter's resolve at the start of the match like it normally should. Triple Molly Wop, put this dude to rest. Victory! Okay, there's no hiding from the rebels on that one. Let's check out the loots, dudes. Ten more, uh, shards. F Fifty-five thousand. Dineros. Okay, let's see if there's an achievement unlocked for this thing. I need some Vader shards. I could possibly have a seven-star st Vader if there was. Oh, server resets going on. Oh, there he is. I'll activate him later. Maybe I'll do an unboxing video. I don't frickin' know. No achievement. Okay, dude, you just witnessed it. We, uh, got us a frickin' uh, Death Trooper. He's, he's gonna be what, like two or three stars at uh, that le low level? Probably two stars, I believe. But, you know, I'll probably unlock him later. I can't wait to see the what the rest of these events bring on. And uh, this uh, Krennic and frickin' uh, Death Trooper synergy, it's gonna be the new meta. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Here's some friends of this channel. Check them out. Look them up. First up, you got the Reality Scoop Gamers. That's uh, Ranger J, Finity, and Grande Patron. They do a live stream every Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern. You'll see dudes like me on there along with the Smithy D. And don't forget to check out Smithy D's channels. He, he's a frickin' uh, master... Uh, craftsman at uh, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes and uh, he also has a live stream on Saturdays. Check it out. That's where you could uh, ask questions and him and his panel of uh, Master uh, Jedi's will frickin' answer those questions.